Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, Twisted Paper Studio, how are you? I hope that you are all well. Oops. Today is day 35 of the 100 Day Craft Project, it's Saturday the 23rd. I hope everyone is well, thank you for joining me. If you're new here, welcome. Whoops. Um, let's get started here with today. Today we're going to be um, continuing to work in some of the books that I started in the beginning of the 100 Day Craft Project. So this is the bunny book that we were working in. I may pull out some other books, but right now I'm going to concentrate on this one. And I will give out my beautiful blessings. If you're new here and you say hello to me, I give you out beautiful blessings. That's kind of like saying hello to somebody who I don't get to see. So beautiful blessings to Liz Anderson, Celeste at Woodland Inspire, Betty Freckles, Angie Belmont, Alana H., Barbara Chocolate1956, Anne's World, Anna Milford, and Sue Schweikert. Beautiful blessings to you, ladies. Thank you for commenting on my channel so I know you are there. So let's get started with today. So um, basically what I'm trying to do is finish up these books so that I can have them ready and done by the time the 100 Day Craft Project ends. I hope that I could. Um, yesterday, I made Twisted Tangles, as you guys all saw, if you saw the video. If you haven't seen the video yet, go over and take a look. It's a fun video. Um, using up your scraps. And these were some of the scraps I had. Um, I don't think they're going to be strong enough. They're glue book pages with, I mean, where the scraps are, are strong enough. I was thinking about using them for the pocket in the front here. Oh, uh, it might kind of work if I put something else behind it. I like that. It's kind of cute. But then I would have to find something to put on it. Oh, how darling. It's going to cover up the whole thing. So maybe not that. How about a bunny? Maybe a bunny. Or that little girl. Oh, maybe I might put her. Let's see. So anyway, we're just crafting. Um, um, and putting things together is kind of like a craft with me. Sorry, I lost my train of concentration for a moment. It's just kind of like a craft along with me. And we're just putting things together and doing random things in this book today. That's what we're doing. I'm going to see if this will cut this. It might. Oh, it will. Okay. Hopefully it comes out. Yay. All right. Now let's see. Where did I put my garbage bin? Oh, here it is. <clears throat> I like her right there. I may just have to clean that up. So let me do that. And then we're going to keep going through the book to see what I can do. Um, hold on. Let me get my bearings. <clears throat> How are all of you? I hope you're all well. I think I asked that in the beginning. Huh. Sorry if I'm repeating myself. I'm just going to straighten this up because it doesn't look quite so straight. It probably is. It's probably just the um, collage. That's making it look not straight. And then I might take a little piece of fabric. I got this fabric in Happy Mail. Isn't it just darling? I don't know if the colors are right though. That I don't see any pink in there. So um, oh, how about my favorite piece? <laughs> I don't have much left. It scares me. But it's so pretty. And it goes because I have some other places in the book that it's in there. Oops, sorry. I pulled something from my cart and something else fell. Okay. Okay. This is Fabri-Tac glue in here for anyone who's new. It takes a minute for it to come out. Okay. 
and I'm just gonna tack it down like that and I'll put the ripped edge at the top I left a little bit more space at the top there because I'm gonna give it a snip to show that it's a pocket. We'll put her right on there. How darling. She's so cute. And then I'll just go ahead and snip this here. And let's see how we want to put this in our book. Let me just put this down more. I didn't put it down all the way at first because I wasn't quite sure what I was going to be doing. Now I kind of know. There we go. And I don't think I'm going to glue right here. Normally I leave it open so that more stuff can go in. So I'm just going to do the two sides. So this side and then the bottom. And fabric tack glue dries pretty fast. Okay, now we have a pocket in the beginning of the book. I did go ahead and um, sew some of the pieces from the collage that we've done, so I may insert them in. I'm just trying to get these books ready for the end <laughs> in May. Okay, I liked all this. I like this. So cute. I've forgotten some of the work I've done in here. Let me take a sip of water. Okay. Now what do we have here? I do have some fussy cut things already out. So I'll go ahead and look at what I have. I have a big pile on my desk, you guys. Huge. Look, a cupcake. Oh, I like that. I like the cupcake there. Maybe I'll just put a pop of color behind it. Hold on. Let me take a look. <clears throat> oh, I like that. We'll just go ahead and do that. I may have to open the door over here near me because I'm getting kind of a little hot. We'll see. I think it's from the lights above me. So just do a little collage on there and we'll do these little cupcakes. I think that's in one of my kits in the ephemera. I just don't remember which one. If you ask me, I'll try to find it. I mean, it's a grape card. I need something without paint on it. Otherwise, the paint will smear on the page. Okay. So, moving along, this has a journal tag in here that we've done before. And a card on there. Like I said, this is pretty close to being done. Just have to take a look at some. I don't want to cover everything because I want to leave room for others to do things in it. Piece of rag paper. Journaling. Oh, yes, and the cute little thing we made in here with the carrots. How cute. <laughs> I, oh, yeah. I did put this in here as a reminder, so let's go ahead and fix that. There's a little tear in this journal, in this page here. This is real ledger paper, 
So I want to fix it. So I think what I'm going to do is put this on here. And I don't want to cover any of that beautiful writing. So I think I'm just going to clean up that edge there. Let's take a look. Perfect. And I'll glue that on. And I'm going to check the back to make sure and see if I don't have to glue there too. Okay, that will fix that rip. And then, yeah, I think I'll put a piece there too. And I'll just do it below the number. So this way I'm not covering up any of the ledger. And I think I am gonna go and crack my door. It's been raining here all day today. But I'm getting um, a little hot. I think it's from the lights. I have two lights over me. So hold on just one second. Okay, thank you for waiting. All right, and I think I'm gonna leave that just like that. It's nice to see the old book page in your work. Is, is my camera good? Let me do that. All right, okay. So you can see everything. We, we did these pockets here. Maybe we'll just do something on here, this plain book page. A little something. How about her? We'll just put her up there. She's cute. Maybe I'll just do a little piece of collage there. The book page has a tiny mark on it, so I don't know what it's from. So we'll just do a little collage on it and make it look pretty. No reason. <laughs> you don't need any reason to do collage. You really don't. You could just do whatever you want. I like this pink to tie in with this pink. Like a peach. Let's see. Let me get a straight line. One second. Okay. Even though I didn't feel good yesterday, I went to babysit my grandson. I had the best time. He's not feeling well either. He's actually the one who got me sick, so. <clears throat> he got his nanny sick, him and Lucas. Just sinusy stuff. And there's nothing you can take for it. So it just has to go away on its own. Okay. Whoops. There we go. That's cute. All right. We need something back here. It's very plain. How about we put a little tag back there? Let me take a look at what we have. We have a lot of stuff that we did in the 100 day so far, believe it or not, a lot. That's Christmassy. Blue.
talking about that? That's cute. Whoops. We'll put this right on the page. It has a paper clip, so we'll just go ahead and stick it on. And then this was, I clipped a piece of the twisted tangle on here. So it was on the back too. So when you slip it on the page, oh, it's covering her up. When you slip it on the page, it does that. So let's move it, hold on. Let's move this to the other side, like that. Let's do that, or there, let's do that. And then I can put this right on here like this. And we have that over there and that over there, cute. Okay, and then these are in here. I don't know, does that need like a page? I think it needs a page tab. Let me see. <clears throat> I know it's the last page, but still, we'll give it a page tab because of the fact that, I don't know if this is too small, because it's uh, very plain without it. Oh, I was able to get something. Bunny. <laughs> and then we could also do, hmm, let me think. Maybe a little corner. Yeah, we could do a little corner tuck. Because there is something on this side, it will just firm it up on this side, that's all. Okay, I'm gonna put this right here. And you could do it anywhere. It can be up in the corner, it could be down in the bottom corner, the left or right, top left or right. Doesn't really quite matter. And then maybe we'll give some stamps in here so that somebody else can play with things in the book. Just want it to stay. I gotta make sure it stays first. <laughs> Put the stamps in, and maybe this little guy. Put him in there, and maybe a little tag. something in for somebody else to play with. Fussy cut. Oh, I like that flower on there with those flowers. Or maybe a bunny. I like the bunny on there. Let's put the bunny on there. Let's 
How did I get myself in this mess? I'm in a mess on my desk. I'm afraid of dropping anything. That's because I put everything over here so that I would get it easier. <laughs> Silly me. Okay, I like him right here. Cute. And if you're new here to my channel, most of these digitals and all these bunnies and all that I'm using here is in the in my Etsy shop. You can also get paper packs in my Etsy shop with this rag paper. I think with this needs a little tab. Let's see. No. Mm, no. This I just wanted to put in a pocket somewhere without, for no reason. This needs a page tab. Let's put one on. Um, should we put on a purple one? Yeah, let's do it. hands are all gluey again <clears throat> that's the pros and cons of working with glue I have a, a piece of my own hair on my hand somewhere sorry okay I'm gonna put this right here cute oh okay I thought I did two pages together I would have cried let's put him right in the middle <laughs> just working on this book seeing what we can get done we might get it done today I don't know where are we at a half hour who knows cute there's writing space here a little tall but here you know I'll, I'll leave that for writing space what about here we can make it a belly band hmm let me see it's a little short oh here it's perfect for a side tuck I think I'll do that yeah, let's make this a side tuck inside. And I just have to take a sliver off the top there. Yeah, and then I'm just gonna take a notch out of there so that everyone knows it's a side tuck. <laughs> And then I'm gonna glue up. And these were all from the scraps that we've been working on all week, you guys. Okay, I won't go so far back into the spine um, just so that it doesn't have any troubles closing. So I left just a little bit
I really should have cleaned off my desk before I started the camera. I've been have, working on so many projects with you guys and I just keep going. Cute. I like that. I don't know if I have any. Oh, here. How about this guy? Oh, he's got to go somewhere in here, but not there. Cute. Now, he needs a little something. So, let's see. This is cute. I'm all just... get my fabric scissor save a piece <laughs> and then put it down here like that and we don't need that green thread and then mm, on my tool Let me just look here. I see something. I like that too. Very Eastery. I have, maybe I should wash my hands. <laughs> they got glue, glue from everything. Okay, first let's do this. So I'm gonna put this on here. And I just want a little sliver of this. Now, I don't know where I got this from. I've had it for forever. It's just my stash I'm using up. And I'm going to do that, that thing that we do. Or that I do. <laughs> I'm going to make a hole. gold and put this in there this piece got away you don't want that and then take the the nail head part and put it down into the upside down hat and squeeze it there we go okay perfect I like the gold because it kind of matches the gold in here and just put that in there. Cute. Cute, cute, cute. This book is coming out so darling. Okay. We have this here. Let's see. Oh, how cute. Let's put them right there. <laughs> Let's just do it. So we're just decorating our pages in here. Um, maybe I might do it just about there so that you could, the person can see that and that. I mean, it's in German. <laughs> Cute. All right. Should we do something on that side too? And then we'll put her. Yeah, she's a little sweet bunny. We'll just put her right there. I'll leave that for journaling. That's the center. Hmm. I do have to fix this up some and add something to it, but what? I'm trying to look. Mm. 
you know. How about a label? Well, I don't know where my labels are. I do know where they are. Never mind. <clears throat> I thought I was going to have to go on a big search. Not too big. There's a small one in there somewhere. I think that will look cute. Maybe I'll do it with a little piece of fabric under. Where's the, here. Yeah, I think I want it like that. Just a little piece of fabric sticking out on both sides. I'll glue that on. Whoopsie. We're gluing everywhere. Okay. I like that. Cute. Let me see if I can get this in here. Hold on. I didn't realize that this, I glued this down here. Oh. Better. Like that. I like that better. All right. It's a journaling tag. And we'll just put it right here. And when I have this in my stash, we'll just use it. It's an old paper clip. There we go. Okay. I may do some something here with beads. I think. I think. I think, I think. Or something. Oh, that's pretty plain. So we need more stuff. Just when you think you're almost done, you're not. Well, I like the roses there, but they need to be, um, put the, I need to put the dye on them, the ink. Um, hmm, 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 hmm. Let me see. I don't know where it is. So I'm just gonna use this because I found my little nubby things. I've been looking for my um, my my felted bunnies for Lucas's journal. I can't find them. And Easter is coming. <clears throat> How about you put it over here where there's more blank space on the side? Okay, I'm going to rinse my hands here in the hand sanitizer. 
best way to get off the glue. So give me one second. I'm just rubbing it on my hands to get it off. Okay. Yeah, if you have hand sanitizer in your craft room, it cleans all the glue off your tools, off your hands, off your desk. It really does a good job. <laughs> No, I, I'm not a spokesperson for it either. How about we just put some flowers in here? Possibly. Ay, ay, ay. Like that. Maybe just three little flowers. That looks cute. For no reason, just because. So we'll do one, and then two. Ah, this glue, glumpy, glumpy glue. Two, and then three. Pretty. Perfect. Okay. Oh, maybe we'll do a tab there. Mm. Hold on, I'm just going to get it off of a larger sheet of paper. Oops. This book is turning out so adorable. I love it so much. I don't know how I'm going to let it go. Mm -hmm. Okay. There we go. And now, what happened? Oh, it was stuck. Oh, that scared me. Let's see. Those are guys are cute there. So I think I'm just gonna staple them in this way. If somebody wants to remove them, they can. Maybe, should I back them? No, I'm just gonna staple them right in. Like that. And this is journaling. Here's more tags. Cute. So cute. Rag paper. Oh my goodness. Nope. No, too matchy. Maybe this needs a tab though, possibly. Yeah, let's do a tab on there. There we go. And how about in there? That's better. Okay, good. Oh my gosh, we're on the last 
signature, you guys. How about we put him on a little page right there? He's cute. Let's do it. Cute. And C is for zero. <laughs> Okay, what do we have more stuff? No, I don't want to cover anything up. Mm-hmm. I'm trying to see what else I have in here. Oh, he's cute there. Let's put him there. Okay. I mean, I'm, I left myself no room. No room whatsoever. Should we put the chickies there? No, the bunny. The bunny. Yes, the bunny. The bunny wins. <laughs> Half the time, the bunny wins in my case. I always choose the bunny first. Mostly. Second would be the duck. <laughs> A little ducky. Oh, so cute. And D is for ducks. Look at that. <laughs> um, let me just see about a page. No, it doesn't really quite matter. It's very short. All right, journaling, journaling, journaling. Maybe we need some more here. How about another card? That's already in the front. I don't think that's in here. Oh, I know this is not in here. So how about the bunnies? And all of this ephemera, you guys can find this in my shop, uh, in the bunny kits. And there's, there's a special folder for Easter stuff. Let's do that. We'll put him down first. Okay, and then we'll just staple him on again here on this side and the other side. Let's do a little bit of collage there so we can make some journal a journal spot. might be working. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, so I'm just going to clean this up and make it a journaling spot. And it looks nice because the page before it is blue. Just rip that this way so the white is can't see it. Good. So if ever you have a book page in your book and um, you want to make it a journaling spot, you just cover it with some 
you know, backer page that you would print on or some some package paper. You can do that, but use packing paper too. Now let's put your journal on. Cute. Ooh, put those guys up there. I need to do more fussy cutting now because now I used my fussy cutting in this book. <laughs> Put this in here. How about we put that on there? Or maybe a pop of a color. Yes. <coughs> the yellow one. Excuse me. And take a sip of water. Where are we at? Ooh, 46. We're almost. <coughs> we did a lot. Decorating. We did a lot of decorating, you guys. There we go. Pretty. I want to do something special here. So maybe we'll stop on this. We'll work on this some more tomorrow. We'll finish it up. That's what we'll do. So I'm going to put a mark in here. And we're almost done. We only have a few pages left. That's really it. And let me see. Can I mark it with? I need something that I know will be the mark. This. This is good. I'll mark it with that. Okay. So thank you for joining me today. I hope you guys, it, I've inspired you guys to also decorate your inside of your journals with, you know, ephemera and placing it in places, um, gluing things down, making pockets. It's lots of fun, you guys. Um, you know, just get creative. I think I like this here. Oh, yeah, that's going to go there. We'll have to put something else there. Get creative. Think outside the box. Add stuff, you know, all your scrapbooking stuff to your tags and things like that to make them cute. Oh, yeah, this too. This has to go in here too. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Let's find one more and then we'll call this a day. Should we do this one? Yeah. Let's do those three in the front. Darling. Okay, cute. All right. So we'll call this a day. These are all the things we've been making over the 100 Day Craft Project. So if you're new to my channel, go take a look around. You'll see um, what I use to make them and, and get inspired to also make your own. Okay, bye for now, my crafting buddies. I'll see you guys again tomorrow for, um, let's see, what's tomorrow? Day 36. Okay, see you soon. Bye. Thank you for watching.